Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. Barbadians are constantly crying out about how hard things are and things are not getting any better when we talk about, when you talk to me about the food prices. It's, I can hear it in your voices how bad it is when you go into the supermarket and you have to not buy certain things because it's so expensive. You talk about energy costs, you know, for electricity and your water bill. Everything is so high in Barbados, yet you see this heading that Rihanna is home to launch a beauty line. And I don't know if you know this, but a lot of beauty products are not regulated. You, do, you don't really know what you're putting on your skin and your skin is an, the biggest organ on your body and you're absorbing all of those products that they have in these lipsticks and creams or whatever else that you're buying. And you wonder, how can you afford to buy cream that is overpriced? How are you affording to buy lipstick that you don't need you, you don't need lipstick. How are you affording to buy these things when you're crying out at the supermarket? When you're begging people for money? When these people that are there to launch whatever are already rich? Why are you in a situation where you are so poor and hurting, but yet you're willing to draw money on products that are mostly unregulated. In the United States, the beauty industry, mostly unregulated. Why are you willing to do that? Why are you willing to have human gods? <laughs> human gods and make them rich. Keep yourself poor. That's what you're doing. You're making people rich and keeping yourself poor. Why are you willing to spend money behind someone that shows up at an event in a thong, big pregnant, belly, big pregnant, wearing a thong and, and bra. Like, they don't care about themselves. They don't care about what you're saying about them. They're still thinking, and they're probably right, that you're going to spend money on them. You're going to throw your money at them. You like that, don't you? You like that, and they know you like it. Okay? So when I see this launch of Beauty Line, in Barbados and the most beautiful person you can ever look at is someone who is naturally beautiful, naturally clean. You just bathe and you just put a little bit of, you know, moisturizer, olive oil, olive oil. I've even started using um, the heavy one, the castor oil, the one that our moms used to make us drink, that thick one. And then you get a piece of lime or a piece of orange to, to, to wash it down with. I've started using that on the edges of my hair to keep my hair all night, you know, nice and supple. And you know, instead of buying those um, those gels to, to have that, that shine and that slick down look, I've, used, I've started using um, castor oil. That's the name, castor oil. Yeah, these things are readily available and, you know, you don't have to break the bank, to buy stuff like that. And you just stay away from, do you pack your face with makeup and powders, stop it from breathing? Or is that what you're doing? Even deodorant, use it sparingly. And just, if you take a shower, you know, try not to lather yourself up with a lot of creams and, and perfumes. It's all being absorbed into your blood, into your blood. A lot of people go to the doctor and a lot of things show up in their blood because of the products you're putting on your skin. You're making people rich and hurting yourself. You're, you're, you're giving yourself so many ailments, so many such. You are destroying yourself. What? To make another human being that shits and piss. They're pissing and they're shitting. Just like you. Just like you. They have to eat. They have to sleep. So you're you're willing to give your life away, put yourself on the burner so that these people become filthy rich. Filthy rich. They don't have enough. It, it, it's insatiable that uh, that appetite for money and fame is in, and you're willing to support that when you are crying out at the supermarket. You're crying out at the supermarket, but yet have money for 
a beauty line when you are ready who you are no matter what kind of makeup you put on when you shower and it comes off and it should come off you, you, you should not keep it on because it's not good for you but when you shower and you take it off you are who you are you are who you are you have to look yourself in the mirror and say you're beautiful you're beautiful just the way you are okay so I have nothing more to say about this but you guys need to get it together you're gonna to have to see the game for what it is and you you have to see yourself being played you're being played and you have to see it. there's nothing anyone can say you're gonna to have to come to that realization all on your own but um, in the meanwhile keep your money to buy your food keep your money to pay your rent to pay your mortgage keep your money to pay for your utilities and if you have entertainment coming into the house you know you have you know the subscription people that you know you watch movies and you watch them shows keep your money to make sure that you are comfortable that you could have gas to put in your car you know the tank and everything keep money for that don't worry about people who are already rich and trying to sell you a line of product that is not really regulated it's not it's not just read up about it okay this is sherry veronica